falls to the ground. A murder deep in the heart of Mentopolis. A city in a mind, a mind in a city. The lights are all on and bodies hustle to and fro. Feels like high time we talked about the direction this fair city's headed in. For your consideration, watching at home, the mind of one Elias Hodge, the synaptic switchboard at the heart of Cerebell's Pacific, the company that runs... <laughs> Guys, this is really serious. Stop laughing. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of these puns, okay? <laughs> I'm Detective Hunch Curio. If there's one thing I love, it's questions. If there's two things I love, it's money. And if there's three things I love, it's coffee. My character is an impeccably dressed, mysterious woman. I'm being followed, Mr. Curio. Hmm. I'm being followed by heaven knows who. My character is a tension, a tough scrabble reporter, a body. Oh, I mean, a body. Dan Fox, the proprietor of the club, the purveyor of all pleasures, earthly and otherwise, spelled however you want. I think we know how it's spelled. Uh, <laughs> Conrad Schintz, a small boy, kind of too small. Justin, you're my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you're my best friend, too, but we just tend to say it after something real sad. <laughs> I'm the fix, a manifestation of the system that allows for hyperfixation. Did you know that for every snake on Earth, there is one snake dick? You know, only half of snakes have dicks. And that means that every snake that has a dick has two dicks. And that's a true fact about our world. <laughs> Strap in. Dutch angle, Dutch angle, high contrast, high contrast. <laughs> Huge shadow, Huge shadow, big shadows. What is happening? You son of a bitch. Will you do this dirty task for me then? Did you know that more than half the bones in your body are in your hands and feet? Oh, bonjour, hello. Oh, well, I don't speak that. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why couldn't we do the right thing? Neat. Yes. <gasps> I told you. It's the best anybody's ever rolled in this game. Truly wild. Light fills the room, and you behold what the big guy beholds. 